It's Kitchen Dads coming to you from Maui, Hawaii. We were at the Napili Farmer's Market a couple times this week and we picked up some great fruit. Um, Nick is, loves fruit. And so what we thought we would do is we'd do a little, um, like a fruit plate and kind of explain to you some of the some of the fruits maybe you're not used to seeing. So Nick, what should we start with? Pick one. That one. This. So these are organic lemons. Now, uh, the the rind of the lemon is not as thick as the commercially produced lemons. Uh, they have a great, great, great flavor. They smell wonderful. Don't worry, I'm going to see. Isn't that more mild, more, a more mild taste? And it's not as bitter. Um, it's it's really, it's a, it's a wonderful lemon. Um, a lot of people in California have lemon trees, fruit trees. In Atlanta, we don't get as many because it gets a little colder. But uh, these are really great. So what else should we try, Nick? Oh, so this is, you know what this looks like? You know, you know what this is? Well, it's an apple banana. It's like, it's a miniature banana. Now this was put in the fridge, so that's why it turned brown. But even though, and so don't put your bananas, any kind of bananas in the fridge, because the skin will turn brown. But the inside's still really good. And if you want to try this, Nick, Tell me if it tastes just like a regular banana, or is it a little more uh, creamy? Creamy. It's a little more creamy. It has more of a tropical taste to it, right? All right, what else we got next? Coconut. Now, we went on the road to Hana earlier this week, and we stopped at a couple different places selling coconut. A um, bit of a comparison. This is some of the interior of a young coconut. So when you see the big green, you know, what you think maybe um, you see in movies and television, the, the big green green, that's a young coconut. And this is very flexible, it's very pliable, much softer. This is kind of the interior of the coconut, uh, which the ones that you'll see falling down on the ground. Uh, the gentleman we spoke with said that these are about uh, 18 to 24 months aged, and it's really tough on the inside. You're, you're not have to. I'd have to cut it out. It's much more tough than this. But you can make some great things with this. You can get shaved coconut. Um, there's a gentleman on Hana, that would be Coconut Willie, who takes this and he shaves it on a mandolin, puts a little bit of organic cane sugar on it, and then he uh, bakes it for 18 to 24 hours and it makes wonderful, wonderful coconut candy. That's how I got to like coconut. So, um, Nick, what else we got? What do you think this is? Fruit. It's a fruit. Well, right there. So everybody, you know, this is a mango, right? You can tell it's ripe because it's reddish and kind of uh, yellow. Um, they're green. Um, you can buy them a little bit green and let them ripen. Uh, there's a pit in here that's kind of like flat and curved like this. So you just can't cut it in half. You want to kind of cut it along an angle like that. Now, what I like about mango is they're super, super sweet. You wanna try some of this? They're kind of slippery too. Isn't that good? Very tropical here in Hawaii, also in the Caribbean. Uh, great to make uh, uh, mango salsa. Um, oh, just eat mango by itself. All right, what else we got? Nick. Calamansi. I know it looks like a miniature orange. It's not. Uh, it's not a kumquat. As a matter of fact, and we won't make Nick try this, it looks like an orange on the inside, but it's really sour. It's uh, like a lemon, right? So it's, 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 it's like a citrusy lemon. Um, what I'm told, people make, like to make lemonade from them here. Uh, it's not, it's not sweet. It's definitely not sweet. You wanna try some of this? No. No. Nick Smart. But it's a calamansi. Right. So what else we got, Nick? So key limes. So key limes are a little bitty lime. Um, you can see here as compared to some of the other limes that we have. The different sizes between the key limes. It's some organic limes. Key limes are found uh, a lot in Florida. Um, 
they're a more, they're still sour, but they're more of a, a lighter, if you can have a lighter lime taste. A lot of people know these from a key lime pie, which is very famous. So it's, it's unless you have key limes, it's not an official key lime pie. And they, want to taste this one? It's good. It's, 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 it tastes like limes, but it doesn't have that punch. It's a little more, a little more mild. And Nick, while we have these here, let's talk about the different types of other limes, right? So this is an, this is a commercially produced lime. You can see the rind is much thicker. It's green. It doesn't have a lot of juice. This is an organic lime from here, from Hawaii. They, uh, you can see the difference. This one has a little more seeds. This one is seed free. But from a juice standpoint, we can get a lot of juice out of this one. And this one, because it's commercially produced, tends to be dry, right? That isn't for all commercially produced lines, but that's what we have here. All right, Nick, what else we got? This is our lemon, we covered those already. What else we got? Can you guess what this is? It's a fruit and it's the shape of... No, tell me, tell them. Rectangle? A rectangle, yeah, it's a star fruit. Star fruit's great, it's very decorative, and the nice part is, it's all edible, because when you slice it, it makes a cool little star. And it's really kind of yummy, take a bite. How would you describe that, Nick? Kind of like an apple. Kind of like an apple. But like a really kind of a juicy apple with a citrus thing. That's really nice. All right. I'm going to put those over here. What else do we have? Whatever that may be. This, of course, is just a regular old grapefruit. But it's an organic grapefruit. You can see the skin isn't all perfect. Again, a lot of the commercially produced grapefruits are like really, really thick. This one is nice and pink on the inside. And it's really juicy. And it's a little more naturally sweet because it's organic. Let's take a bite. Mm. Good. Just growing up, I love grapefruit. Of course, my mom used to put sugar on them, so why wouldn't I? What wouldn't look good for All right, we're running down here. We got two more things left. We're gonna go with a papaya. Now we know the papaya is ripe because it's yellow or a little bit reddish when it um, turns ripe, uh, kind of like the mango, and it's not all super green. You take the papaya, you cut it in half. Actually pretty cool on the inside. Just some seeds. These seeds are not edible. All right, so let me Put them here in the trash. All right, we're back. So you clean out the papaya. You take some lime and you squeeze some lime juice over them. And that's it. And it's really kind of tasty. The sweet and the sour go to good together. All right. You sure you want to try this? It's really good. All right. What do you think? See? Better than you thought. And last but not least, alright, is alright, you know I'll take it. Is you guess what this is? It's not a plum. It is a star apple. The gentleman we bought this from at the farmer's market said there's only a few trees on Maui that have these. He was lucky to get them. And uh, let's cut one open. The skin is not edible, but look at the inside. Isn't that cool? Obviously the stars, because there's a star pattern, there's some big seeds that are in here. They're kind of weird because it's kind of gelatinous. And then, let's take a slice and taste it. You want to taste this? Mm okay. Alright, you know what, I'll taste it with you. Alright, let's taste it. Mmm. Um, I don't know, that's like a plumish, 
sweet. Um, it's really good. Almost like a heavy pudding consistency that's sweet and has a tropical light flavor. So anyway, those were our fruits from the farmer's market. Hope you enjoyed. And if you ever get to Hawaii, I advise you to just check out some local markets because you're going to learn so much more than just going to the grocery store or standing at your resort. Enjoy.